Hey there, today we're going to discuss the wonderful song called By the Mark. It's on page four, gospel book number three. And this song was written by David Rawlings and Gillian Welch back in 1996, fairly new. It's one of my favorites by them, and uh, I hope you like it too, and, and I had to include it in this book here. So let's get down to it. Okay, typically this song is in the key of C for Gillian's voice, and they've arranged it to create two beautiful two-part harmonies during the verses and a call and response style during the chorus. Also, during the second line of the verses, they jump into a single 3-4 measure, which is easy if you count two beats and then start the third line of the verse, uh, start singing it uh, to hit that third beat like this. So, when I cross over Okay, now let's talk about the intro. We take the last two lines of the chorus. Uh, I will know and then you come in, so that's what they're doing, the last two lines of the chorus. And then for the breaks in between, you're just doing... last half of the, <laughs> the actually last line of the chorus, so you just repeat that. Okay. 
Now, if you're looking to add some performance flair, we love to have the performance flair. As usual, I like to incorporate various hammer-ons and pull-offs and some easy two-note harmony licks. And uh, these they add, they add a lot to the song if you can do them in tastefully and then keep a little bass pattern going. It really brings the song to life. So feel free to give them a go and make them your own. But I'll uh, do things like... Um, you do around in the G chord is basically is you know around that uh, third and fourth string a lot of those and that fifth string and your two note uh, slide ups when you feel like you need them fits in there in that song as well. Uh, so experiment with those kind of things and uh, add your own little personal touch with it. But uh, just remember to keep the beat going, the strum pattern going, the singing going. It's it's a great song to sing along to if you have a partner to sing harmony with. But uh, by yourself, it's still a wonderful song. So take the song, learn it for the week, and we'll see you next Sunday.